Welcome to Summer Movie in the Kitchen. Today we will cooking a breakfast item from the Sonic Cookbook. And the item we're gonna cook is... The Future Proof Egg Tarts. Which is one of Silver's special breakfast items. We will each have special jobs in the kitchen. Mine is the oven runner, where I will be cooking the egg tart and cooking the bacon. And mine's gonna be cutting and slicing. Shh, shh, shh. And I'm going to mixing and measuring. Let's, Let's get, get cooking! cooking. The first rule in cooking is to wash our hands. All right, I'll start first. I'm gonna head on over. And Ringo. Can't forget about Ringo. Okay. Alrighty, next up, we are gonna show off all the ingredients needed for Future Proof Egg Tarts. Okay, these are our items, each food item that we need for the recipe. Alright, one sheet puff pastry defrosted, five eggs, one teaspoon of dehydrated garlic flakes, one teaspoon of black sesame seeds, one and a half teaspoon of poppy seeds, one and a half teaspoons of flaky salt, four ounces of cream cheese, room temperature, two ounces of Madonna cheese, shredded, zest of lemon, Two scallions, white and light green parts chopped, and eight slices of bacon cook until crispy. Awesome. So these are all the items we are going to be using in this Future Proof Egg Tart recipe. And yeah, are you guys ready to get cooking, chopping, and mixing and measuring? Are we ready for all of it? Yes. All right, let's get going. All right, guys. We got all of our ingredients prepped and we're each gonna do our cooking task, so let's get going. I gotta preheat the oven to 425, so I'm gonna do that right away. People are gonna be cleaning the puff pastry sheets. Puff pastry sheets in forks. 425. All right, that's preheating. Now we don't have um, with us, it says parchment paper on a baking sheet, but uh, we don't have parchment paper, so we're just gonna be using Pam on the baking pan here for the non-stick. There we go. Then once Pipa does his, um, Put in puff pastry, then you're gonna put the puff pastry right on, right on here. I'm gonna take this. So, I'm making my forks. So now I'm gonna cut it. You know, once you cut the puff pastry, then you want to prickle it with a fork, okay? Yes. I'm going to prick it. Looking 
good. Cam's over there doing his egg. His one egg. Pipa is going to be cutting the puff pastry. Mm. Four twenty-five. All right, that's preheating. So yeah, that looks pretty good, and then we'll just take the brush, when he goes down, we'll take the brush and we'll brush it on there. If you want to start working on uh, combining the dry ingredients, you can start working on that. And I can take this over by my station. This ready to go. Now I'm going to take these and put them over on a pan, yep. the baking pan. Here. Oh. I'm set this right here for now. Here. Here. And one here. I'm going to put this back over by Egan. Yep, we'll put the egg wash on those here in a sec. Alrighty guys, so once we got these on here, I'm going to... We can have our own space, kind of. Here we go. So once we got those on, we need to put the egg wash on them. So, I'm gonna take this egg wash that can nicely blend it up for us. And I'm gonna spread it on the pastry. I missed that I'm gonna take the egg wash and spread it all nice on there. Yeah, start combining the dry ingredients. Um, all the measures are there. Yeah, so garbage. Okay, you got all those combined? Yep. Alright, then we'll just sprinkle these on over here. I'll bring this over. I'll bring it over to you and sprinkle it on. Ready, everybody? I'll bring these around. And the egg wash on. Just sprinkle it around the edges. Okay, just along the edges here. Oh. Like that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because the egg is going to go right there in the middle. We're all really These are a lot smaller. We're to do this for the Sonic food. We never done Sonic. Okay. Awesome. We'll yeah, set these into the fridge, done. so once we got these done, we will bring them on over to the fridge. And try and make room for it. I'm going to cut the scallions and cut them from about here to about here. Get this part right here.
Alrighty, can I just someone spit out the D's on here? Right? Alright, I just, I just put my yep. But this is looking pretty good. I'm getting the egg bar. Okay, we have this. Now we don't have a cheese grate or. These mustard cheese might be a little smaller than the one. For the lemon to get the, the skins off, I'm going to use a paring knife. And not to cut it too deep. There you go. I got my stuff. Okay, I'm gonna chop these up. So once we got these done, we will bring them all over to the fridge. I'm gonna do it. Try and make room for it. Do we have a chopper? We do. Do you want it? Yeah, if they want them chopped up. Get that up. Right, one of these people dicer. Yeah, if they want them chopped up. Yeah, we'll chop them up nicely. Maybe that's what we need to do with the lemon too. Mm -hmm. I don't know if they want the lemon chopped up like that. I'm not sure. How did you say? Oh, the pinch and claw, yeah. Pinch and claw, you can learn. So, when you do the pinch and claw, you want to pinch the knife. Want to pinch it? Yeah. Yep, and then you want to claw the food, keeping your fingers oh, tucked in yeah. and your thumb in there. And you want to... Okay. Smells really good though, Peepa. Smells great. Alright, I'm going to chop this up. Cool. Two ounces, we just kind of measured it out to one third cup for our safe. But if you can measure out two ounces easier, do it that way. That's just how we did it. I'll get going on the bacon actually. Okay, I'm gonna go on the bacon. We're gonna put it on the bacon. Where's your bowl? Here's the bowl right here. That one. And Cam, when you get that cheese measured, you can put it in that bowl up. People just check. All right, guys, so I'm gonna cook the bacon. Okay. That one nice and When that timer goes off, you can take the puff pastry out of the... Yeah, man, what do you need? Take this. Yeah, just put it right in the bowl. Just throw her in. Okay, so now I'm gonna zest the lemons here. All right. I already pe got the peels, and then I'm gonna chop them up We got here. the bacon going here, y'all. It's not gonna hurt, because it all goes into one bowl. Perfect. Now I'm going to move the board. Scrape the board up. There we go. And we're good. Just like that. Just like a professional man. Oh yeah, cut the yeah, cut the cream cheese in half. In half? Exactly. Each each one? Yep. I really I don't have a And then uh what's with that? 
So just like... We'll just put them in there? Yeah, but I have to combine it. Combine the... Okay. You have just All of this? Or just... Just the half. Just a half? Where does it say here? Cream cheese. Where is it? Well, it's, oh, right here. Four like, ounces. Yeah, which that was eight, so you just need to put it in half. Oh, yeah. Okay. You might want to combine this better. I don't know. The cream cheese might even melt oh. a little bit better. Oh. Just try and mush it in there a little bit. If it works better, you can kind of maybe mush it down with this. Whatever works to get it more mushed. So then you want to... Then you want to just place the mixture right in the middle. Okay, we can take the thing out of the... Out of the... Fridge. Pete, you want to take the thing out of the fridge? Uh, what's that? The sheet, the puff pastries, the sheet of puff pastries are in there. You want to take those out. Where are they at? On the top, right there. They're above right there. So, oh, okay. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. It looks good. You can send them by Cam. Send them by Cam. And Cam, we'll just put a. Uh, look at that. A thing of that just right in the middle. Looks good. Got the bacon cooking. I'm gonna try and get it a little crispy. Oh, the best you can. Then once you get all those lauded, then we can put them in here for 10 minutes. Get the bacon done. Just do a small, yeah, just right in the center. Yeah. Our our version is a lot smaller than the actual thing. And I can get you something better maybe to scrape it off. But... Yeah, we can scrape it off with that and then well, right in the center and then just kind of squish it in there. Because then the egg will eventually You can go still on top use this lemon. Yeah, that should work good. For lemon juice. Yeah, we might need that for other recipes. I'm gonna put it back in the bag and back in the fridge. Mm, the bacon smells nice, Pipa. Is it making you hungry? Yes. Yeah, drop it. Perfect, yeah, we'll put that right here in the oven then. I got an oven mitt for you, Cam. Just gonna put that on. You can kinda help me out, I guess, put it in the oven because usually that's my job, but you can help out. Put it on the little rack. Oh, you need to see that with the camera? It'll be okay. okay just put it right in the middle rack. Perfect. Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. Alright, Cam, you can add the eggs and I'll add the bacon. Okay, right. here they are. Eggs freshness. Okay, I'm gonna set this, I'm gonna put it on a pad. Okay. It's actually really hot. If you need one. It's really hot, the pan is, so be careful. Oh yeah, you don't wanna... Yep, you can add the egg, just, egg just gets slot right on there. Okay? Then, once you get the egg, I'll come over with the bacon. Yeah, nice and careful. Oh, 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 oh. That's, it's a little... Here, I'll get a spoon. It's a, it's a little slot. Yeah, try and move it back on there. I'll move it back on there with a spoon. Yeah, that's a there you go. Whoa! <laughs> it's a little slippery. It's, yeah. Just get that yolk right on there. Yeah, there you go. I'm gonna make a little. Yeah, make a little. Make it a little bit more whole. I think that's what we were supposed to do. Is make it more of a whole. Yeah. Cam, we'll make that one yours. I'll give you the crispy bacon. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Careful. Oh, that one worked. Oh. <laughs> stay there, stay there. Yeah, that'll work. Oh, Egan, they are getting close to getting cooked underneath, too. Yeah. 
We just gotta do another 10 minutes to cook the... Slow. Uh, Slowly but surely. And keep, yeah, the bacon will keep, yeah, keep it tied in there. We'll have some extra bacon we can snack, uh, snack on. Easy does it! Oh, no! I got it. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's sitting. That's sitting there. Oh, did it break? Nope, it's still there. Awesome job, Cam. Uh, where's your, uh, yeah? Yep, we gotta put it back in the oven now. Middle rack. I need another one. Where's the other one? Check in there. Where? Last drawer. Where? Over here. Right here. Last drawer over here. Okay. Yo, an extra piece of paper. Yep. Let's go, folks! Take the mint and put it. Open the door, somebody. Yep, open the oven door. Middle rack. Alexa, let's set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Now. Right now. Yep, and once it's done in the oven, then we are done. Then we're done. We can have breakfast. Do you guys want some bacon? Silver's special breakfast. Mmm, that's a little dumb. Some good stuff. The timer went off. We're gonna. Turn the oven off. It sure smells good in here. Oh yeah, we have the fan on. We can just do that. Yeah, it sure smells good. All right. Watch out, Cam. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, okay. that, that egg's not done. Well, that one's a little watery. Yeah. We might have to put it on rolls instead. But... Or they, well, on the picture, it looked a little watery. Yeah. What do you think that's too? Yeah, that's too watery. This is what we got. Well, this one exploded. Which is fine. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so what we could do is do the uh, top, the roast, which puts the heat on the top. Do you think it needs? Yeah, I would. A little longer. Do like, like three minutes. Three minutes with roast. Yep. Yeah. All right, y'all. We're gonna put our so it went in for ten minutes, but we want the eggs to just get done a little bit more. We want to make sure they're done. There we go. So we're gonna go ahead. Three minutes. Let's see. Right there. Roast. And. Okay. Alexa, set the timer for three minutes. Three minutes, starting now. We're, we're gonna give it a taste what does and he, see how we. What does it say? Uh, Silver says we can. We compared notes, and it turns out this recipe is the same here as it is in my time. I like to make these egg tarts because they're simple, filling, and easy to share. It's easy to take on the future with a full stomach. Oh. <laughs> All right, Sonic. That's what Silver said. Oh, Silver. So, with these egg tarts. There's so many characters, I don't know them all yet. Just like Five Nights at Freddy's, I had to know oh. all the characters. Three, two, one. Timer's done. Okay, let's do it. Let's see how it looks. You gotta... Put it right on that pot pad over there. Yeah. We can scrape on our plates, yeah. Do you have one of those uh, right there? Oh, yeah. Or that one. Yeah, and we'll just bring it to each plate. Do you want to shut this up? Or? Yeah, I can turn it off. All right. I can get, bring it over. And if nobody wants the one that broke open, I could do that. That's, that's an extra one. Oh, that's just an extra one. Okay. Here we go. So I'm with mine. This is Cam's crispy bacon. Ooh, yeah. Egg tarts. Oh my god, I the egg. Yep, that's all I'll break that off later. Okay. Hold on. Cam man. Alright, Cam, get the crispy. <laughs> Some more egg bake. And I'll do the corner one. This one? Yep. Okay. Come on here. Hold it. 
I'm behind you, Cameron, so you got to be careful. Okay. <laughs> Slippery. There we go. There we go. Right, just put that on the hot pad. Okay. There we go. All right. We got zero here. I got bubbler. Uh, All right, guys. So these are our little egg tarts. Um, yeah. Looks really good. I'm gonna go ahead and. It's gonna be hot, so you guys gotta be careful. Dig my fork in. Get a little piece of bacon in there. All right. Y'all ready? I got my piece. Ooh. Oh, this looks hot. Blow on <laughs> it. Cool it off, man. <laughs> Crunchy bacon. <laughs> I can hear that. <laughs> All right, are you guys ready? Yeah. Cheers. Ooh. That's pretty good. That is really good. Wow. I'm impressed. I am impressed. Yeah. Too. It's, uh, it's actually pretty good. It didn't look very good, but it tastes really good. It does taste good. Mm -hmm. That is awesome. Mm. Mm. This is an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Flavor is spot on. I think the maple bacon helped because that maple flavor is really nice. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, what do you guys rate it? Out of 10. I'm checking it. Yeah. Keep thinking, yeah, can you get some extra bites? I gotta get some extra bites to make sure. Mmm, that blows up. Oh my goodness. Mm. That was a good recipe. You know, that, um, I can taste that lemon. That mixture makes a difference. Mm -hmm. I can taste the lemon that peep up. I, I can actually taste that a little bit, yeah. But I mean, it's not overwhelming. Yeah. There's just enough in there that makes it right. Mm. What do you think, Cam? Yeah. Oh yeah. Are you got a rating yet? Um, I'll just give it the same thing as eight. Very good, yeah. The flavor is just absolutely amazing. Yeah, the flavor is perfect. Yeah, Cam, with you measuring all the seasonings and stuff, and mm -hmm. absolutely great, and keep on cutting the yep. onion and lemon. And I'm gonna give it I'm going to bite. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to make sure. Very good, guys. <laughs> I'm actually going to give it 8.5. Mm. Oh, okay. It's pretty good. Well, that flavor is absolutely amazing. Right yeah. You guys, if you're at home and you want to find a good breakfast item to make, I recommend this recipe. It's very good. It's very delicious. Yeah. So. Pretty much. Yeah. Otherwise, thank you guys for watching this episode of Summer Movie in the Kitchen. Um, this is an awesome breakfast item. We recommend it. Super good. Um, it just doesn't look the best. Like when I first saw it come out, I'm like, ooh, that's a long, long. But it tastes absolutely awesome. So. Thanks for watching. If you guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button yes. while you're down there because it uh, helps out, help us out helps us out a whole bunch uh, when you guys subscribe and like the videos because we really appreciate it. Some movie crew really appreciates it. And yeah, mm -hmm. and, and thanks for watching. And we'll see you guys in a future summer movie in the kitchen video. Bye, yeah. you guys. Bye Thanks guys. for watching. Woo! Right. Very good.